Hello, social media friends. I'm Viridiana Marquez with DRB Media Communications Digital News, and Danny Barrera has the story. An event to bring awareness and education regarding substance abuse called Living Above the Influence was recently held at the MLK Community Center in Midland. The purpose of the event is to empower parents with information to start conversations with their children to the issues and consequences of underage drinking, drunk driving, and substance abuse. We need more of this in this community for that the kids know where to come to. If they can't come to a parent or a coach or a teacher, they, they know these different organizations that can help them. The opioid crisis is now a major concern with municipalities. The city of Midland is combating the problem through the legal system. Uh, so there's some state organizations working with our local police and making us understand, helping us educate what's, what's happening on the state and the national level. Opioid, as you just mentioned, is a number one killer in a lot of cities in the United States. Mayors are trying to go after those drug uh, organizations, dealerships, and bring in a lawsuit against them. So as a mayor, that's something that I can do is making sure that Millen is engaged in that lawsuit. The event featured interactive displays by the Texas Department of Public Safety and the Midland Police Department that would allow a person to wear goggles to simulate being intoxicated. Do you put on the goggles and you're drunk? Out of a drunk person's eyes, I guess. What did this teach you? To just not drink, not drink and drive. Jane Villanueva, who lost her son to a drunk driver, talked to young teens about the consequences of drunk driving. Visitors at the event also saw the aftermath of a vehicle involved in a crash that took the life of a teen by a drunk driver. There's, you know, we've got to be careful, you know, uh, people drinking and driving out there. It's just, it's, 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 a big, it's something that we need to let out there and everybody needs to, you know, think about it. The event was sponsored by the Midland Coalition, Substance Abuse and Mental Health Services, the Permian Basin Regional Council on Alcohol and Drug Abuse, and food provided by Albertsons. For DRB Media Communications Digital News, Danny Barrera. Thank you for following us on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Also at DannyVisionEntertainment.com. For DRB Media Communications Digital News, Viridiana Marquez.